Hi all, Steph here. And I wanna take an example from several years ago about reframing a moment. Um, the great thing about being in New York City is there are all kinds of teachings, lessons, reminders throughout the day. And uh, you get a glimpse into other people's lives that you normally wouldn't get without all this population and being so tightly packed. There was a, a little kid melting down, having an absolute uh, uh, temper tantrum, crying fit, the whole nine yards, screaming, yelling, tears, the whole piece. And his father looked at him and said, you know what you need? You need an attitude adjustment. Uh-oh, uh-oh, what's coming? And this father scooped him up, gave him this huge hug that immediately changed the energy of the moment, comforted the child, made the child giggle and forget about what his upset was. So I wanna use this to remind us all, one, where and how do we need an attitude adjustment? If we're with someone who needs an attitude adjustment, how can we do that without announcing, you need an attitude adjustment, and bringing the moment to a screeching halt? So I'm curious about your experience with uh, reframing the moment. What can you use and offer up? What's your default go-to? What works, what doesn't? when it's time for an attitude adjustment for you or for someone else in your life. Please share comments below. Uh, find me at rapidbodymindclarity.com if you'd like to connect directly, Steph at stephanieswafford.com. Always a pleasure. Thanks much. Until next time. Cheers.